aftercare is a must have with, with any skincare service, and ultimately waxing is a skincare service. So it's really important that the client knows how to look after their freshly waxed skin at home. And the back and the chest in particular, I don't know if you find this guys as well, but it's really common for guys to get pimples on those areas afterwards. Mm, so so. It can be a result of a post-inflammatory response, so those white blood cells breaking down afterwards, or it can be a bacterial infection if it appears in the, um, the days after the wax. So all of that normal aftercare advice in terms of keeping the skin cool and calm, free from heat and friction applies. But what do you recommend for your guys in terms of retail in particular? Um, yeah, I mean, the, it's best to, to be using something antibacterial on the skin. Um, most guys are gym goers um, and they pers men perspire more than women. So um, if they're uh, coming into the salon and then they're rushing off going back to work, I find that if their pores are open, um, then they're more susceptible to any kind of infection and yeah. follicleitis. I tell all my guys after a back wax to put ideally a clean t-shirt on when they get home, to change their bedding, uh, wear fresh pyjamas if they wear pyjamas, which is always a weird question asking someone what they wear for bed, but it is <laughs> something that comes up. And I always make sure they leave with an aftercare leaflet, um, just reminding them what not to do, because the amount of guys that come for a back wax and then want to just go to the gym that night, they kind of don't get it that the sweating is going to cause spots. And it's about warning them as well, isn't yeah. it? Like you said earlier, the expectations, letting clients know. Yeah. You may get some pimples afterwards, it's nothing to worry about, but this is how you deal with it and this yeah. is what we've got in the salon that you can take away to, to help prevent and treat yeah. it.